Golden of Eden is a Stephen Schwartz musical. Stephen Schwartz, who's the author of Wicked, who did the music for Pocahontas, The Hunchback of Notre Dame, Godspell, Pippin, and it's a beautiful, joyous, and inspirational musical about children, about faith, but mostly about the relationship between parents and children. Hi, I'm Aubrey Smith, and I am a storyteller in Children of Eden. And I am Alberta Smith, and I'm also a storyteller. The, the show talks about God as the Father, and we as His children, and um, the relationship that happens there, and how you, you, how you try to raise your children. And it, it's kind of an interesting take on it, because it's almost as though God is having to learn these things as it goes along. It's been really wonderful for me um, to work with Mom, because and I don't realize it in, until she's like not at a rehearsal with me that she brings so much to the experience for me that I don't have when she's not there. So doing any show without her, which there haven't been very many, you know, is, is a really strange feeling and I find myself wishing that she was there. So I think that's almost the idea that happens in Children of Eden when you know Eve and Adam really want their father to be there and to talk to them and so do all the generations down through Noah until God does finally choose to talk to them in the show so for me she's she's not God but she is that kind of presence for me I guess in this show that I always want her to be there um, because it it creates something beautiful for me that's not that doesn't happen when she's not there the whole process of what happen, happens with Eve and with Cain where they're reaching out to find whatever is beyond because that's a big theme in the musical is talking about you know dealing with your desire to move beyond where you're at and to discover new things in the world and that kind of that's a passage that Aubrey and I are going through right now because yeah. she's getting ready to go to college and she's graduating from high school and so I really wanted to cherish this time together that I know we have because I know she's going to be going beyond me soon and she won't be oh. here for me to hold her. So this show means a lot to me. I'm Hallie Hunt. I'm the youngest cast member of the play. I'm seven years old and I've been in nine shows. My name's Ashley Hunt and I have two daughters, Hannah and Hallie Hunt, and they're the youngest storytellers in the show. Well, it's neat because they are five years apart and so it's a neat thing that they share together and um, so they're really close and they like to do shows at home and practice at home together and um, Hallie looks up to Hannah a lot and so they, they both actually learn from each other. My sister is good and I like to be with my sister and plays and stuff. We're not from here. We've just lived here four years and the first year was miserable and then we got once we got involved with SLT we felt like we had a family and a home and um, a lot of people to call family and friends since we don't have any here. I'm Connie Dunn and I'm the vocal director for Children of Eden. Connie Dunn is the vocal director for the show and she is my mother. And that has been a real treat to get to work with her, especially on a show that has the theme of generations in it. Yeah, it does make it really special for me. I love working with her anytime I can. And I, what I think is the most fun for me is I watch her um, do in a lot of roles. She's a teacher, she's a mentor, she's a counselor, she's a mother to a lot of people in the cast. And it's all the, the things that I would want her to be and it, it, I enjoy watching her and I enjoy being part of it with her and I appreciate that. I feel like she trusts me that I'm going to promote and support her vision and that makes me happy that she really trusts me to do that. I'm Jody Smith and I am playing Eve. My mom and I were um, in a production of Children of Eden here in 2000 and I was eight years old and she was Eve. My name's Allie Smith and we did Children of Eden in 2000 and I played Eve. So that's really cool to be able to play her role. Um, I don't remember it very well, but I remember moments, and one of them 
One of the moments I remember very vividly is um, the end of Act One, the, the title song. Eve's, Eve's death scene is just really cool and very emotional, and you know, it's it's the music is just soaring anyway, and and um, I could I could really feel the emotion from the audience as that happened, and the entire cast is on stage, and and Eve is speaking to them all, and. She speaks to God and, and talks talks about about the loss of her husband Adam and that she's going to see him in heaven. Father, oh my God, oh, Father, neither Father, I can't see you. You will see me soon enough. Then it's my time to die. It's nearly time. Um, I remember being really emotionally um, upset by that because she was my mom and she was like, you know, dying. And it's emotional. I mean, theater's emotional anyway, but when your own child's on stage with you, and it's just, it's just been really cool. She's been really good about letting me do what I'm gonna do with it. This is the this is the first time she's taken one of the roles I had. So it's just really cool and I'm really proud of her and I'm excited because I love this show. This particular show is just really cool because it's about family and passing things down. And so it's very appropriate. My name is Robert Reed and I am playing the role of father. In the year 2000, when uh, Children of Eden first premiered at the Landers, I was the role of father. It's it is so different this time, I think because it's a different cast, it's a different director, um, and so it has taken on kind of a different quality. It has a, a very special meaning to me because I'm a Christian and I'm very you know, close to that, but it also is very meaningful to me because I have children of my own, and so when we sing about being a father and when we sing about being disappointed or being happy for our children, I totally get what Father is feeling at that time. Children of Eden will be full of surprises. There will be things that you don't expect. There will be moments of elation. There will be moments that take your breath away. Don't miss it.